of movement. We're going to see some nice B reverses, some channeling of the B reverse spirits in this match right like, here. Like, like my man. Like B reverses, no? Yo, B reverses are so clean. In, I'm catching a little they're, in They're so clean. Like, yo, if somebody could B reverse nice, like B. Yo, you nice, B. You get all the honeys if you could B reverse. Right, but it, this is the thing where neutral is going to have to be played, played a bit differently in the sense of... You know, before VV was up against an opponent in Soul Serve, where it's just like he kind of made him approach him. Uh -huh. But with Jules' item play, it's going to be super interesting to see how VV's going to get around there. You know? Uh huh. Okay, we just noticed both players just playing. Okay. Just feel, feeling each other out in the neutral. Yeah, definitely. No real hard commitments, but this is when. Right? And and that's the thing when movement is your key like tool because uh, both of these both of these players and characters movement is their best option when that's it when that's the key to your game plan you have to understand how your character is gonna move as well so you need to know where you need to be and uh, that's why you, you see this feeling out that's going on in this first stop so and, much oh that book nice coverage from Jewel actually purposely letting go of that book to have it go on stage mm -hmm. but because that one forty two. That's okay. a lot of aura right now. Yeah, that's Aura Sphere is going to kill. Don't get hell old, my. No. Yeah. Just, that was brave. My man Jewel is brave. <laughs> Ooh, good air dodge. But how do you make it back? Just going to be. That back air going to clip you. Their back airs, very similar animation. Actually, yeah. Very similar in strength one, as well. One, that one. Both of them will, like, delete you. Oh, look at that. The meat. Yo. 54%. He just got 54% on him from, just, from disadvantage. A this disadvantage This is why parries state. are important. This is uh -huh. why parries are important. Uh -huh. All of that damage, and he... Yo, that book almost fell. Yeah. And he That's actually crazy just put setup. him in disadvantage even more. And Jewel, not confident in that punish. I feel like after that counter... Yo. The back hit? The thunder? library. The library. The library. That's all I have to say. But... The Vivi, back hit. Oh, okay. Yeah, that still Vivi that still hits the some, edge. <laughs> he has to make some adaptation with this. Uh, mm -hmm. You know, he's on, he's on a whole stop. Mm. But if it's anyone that can that can make the comeback, it's yeah. literally the comeback character, yeah. Lucario. Lucario, the comeback kid. Look at, that, look at look how okay. huge that aura sphere is. Damage. Look at him. Just, I love the sounds of like the, these moves in this game. Okay. Uh, be, 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 be careful. Be careful. Be careful. And he did that on purpose, that little uh, L win to, uh, to hit him with the second uh, blast. That was real nice. You know, and notice, notice that BB's being a bit more cautious. Than, BB's being a bit more cautious mm -hmm. as he approaches Jewel. Know, he approaches Jewel. Yeah, absolutely. Thank, I forget names. Thank you. <laughs> it's cool. Now I got you. <laughs> um, and, and that's what you got to do because Jewel has all the momentum right now. Yeah, he definitely does. The forward smash is going to take it. This is what I was talking about. The comeback character. You can never count Lucario out. 90% has all the goddamn can you Yo, let me speak. My man. <laughs> Jewel, and he's not even phased okay, right he's now. Not he's dead. not shook. He's not dead. We're, we're, we're out here. We're out, okay. Up here. Let me get all that. Right. Let me get that curse. real quick. Commentator's curse. Sunrise. That animation is so dope. The up air animation, all the Fire Emblem characters have a very similar up air animation, if not the same thing. But look at that. Combo. Brick all. Yeah, let me did get he, that real quick. Did he Sun, air dodge rise. Or, did he, or did... No. Was that the... Oh, that was the animation? Yep, that, made that was the whole animation. He, he dodged he, it with the animation? Yeah, he just missed the up air. If that, you see the foot, just spacing. missed him. That just so missed him. And it's crazy because the up, uh, Lucario's up air has a pretty big hitbox going towards his, like, back. That was immense. So it looked like behind the foot. Immense. Hitbox not so big. So let me hit your leg real quick. Don't poke this leg out up here, B. We're going back to Pokemon Stadium. One, mm -hmm. um, this this stage definitely seems to be, to, to be a favorite at Xeno. Yeah. And, and like, like we were saying before, it's, Here it's, it's Zeno, pretty good. Here at Xeno, we're civilized New Yorkers. <laughs> <laughs> it's a pretty good, uh, it's a pretty good uh, starter stage for the whole cast. All right, but Vivi noticed, putting on the pressure. Mm -hmm. Looking a lot like last match, though. He got, he got a really good string in the beginning of the of last match. But um, let's see if he can hold on to that. Hold on to this momentum. Sure, Turn exactly. it into a stock. Don't die. Please. Mm. Right, and using that up tilt, noticing that it's hitting him behind. Mm -hmm. And I'm convinced. Lucario's role is, like, pretty pretty large. Because you saw uh, Jewel was standing at a good roll distance just now. And he, like... <laughs> Still rolled behind him. Speaking of distance, notice that when uh, when Vivi actually kind of just got to stage and just air dodged, Jewel just walked away. Uh -huh. Just walked away a bit. All right, that book actually was too bad. 
great and forward smash on missing the tag. Yes, and he he I saw him go for that against I think it was Soul Sir that he played before, yeah. he, uh, and he didn't get it because Soul Sir jumped out of it. But Jewel opted to try and tech, missed the tech, and got deleted for it. Force palm. Let me give you all this palm right here. But Vivi's actually playing so smart right now. He's doing what the matchup is supposed to be. You're uh -huh. supposed to not let Robin set up. You're not supposed yeah. to give Robin space. Pretty much ever. <laughs> because then things like Jewel happen. All right. What? Ooh. What I didn't happened? know who came back to the stage just now. I, I, yeah, I was I was at a loss to be honest. That I really, was weird. I didn't know if Lucario got spiked. I didn't know if Jewel made it back. So it looked like when Jewel upbeat, uh, well Lucario upbeat first and was able to kind of dip around Jewel and in that process hit him and forced the uh, the stage spike. But notice the huge turnaround with Vivi's with Vivi's adaptation and uh -huh. his play style. Right, keep, really just keeping the pressure on uh, Jewel. Yeah, absolutely. This, the, the match is literally, when it really, it's literally a 180 from how it was mm -hmm. before. And there the you same go. exact situation. Up an entire stock. Yep. Now, can BB run with this momentum, or yep. can Jewel bring it back? And Jewel has done some crazy things in his Smash career. Yep. And, and that's the thing. How do you, can you, uh, can you, um, can you stay solid and close out this game without aura? Like, you're not going to get aura yeah, for another it, stock. Yeah, yeah, like, sure. you have a full stock lead. You're not getting that aura right now. Okay. Nice. He's, he's going to land with that there. such a good job. And Jewel doesn't really have an answer right now. That was Yo, my, my guy. Yo, that's why you 3D. That's why you 3D. That was what? That joint was clean. And look at that damage. Two aerials. 33%. My man, VV, is shook right now. Yeah, but I mean, but this is but like you pointed out. Now Vivi is actually gonna start to get aura. Mm -hmm. It's not that much because he's still up, but it is aura and it's Lucario. Oh, 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 he, yo, oh, he's Jewel, you brave because you moving. missed. He missed that tech again. That tech that killed him, stock one. You missed it again. Okay, notice opting instead of going for the forward smash because he knew that he was he was gonna tech. Okay. No, not yet. Not he yet. did opt for okay. the back here. Right. Okay, nice. Gonna get you back to the stage, okay? Just trying to reset the neutral. Mm -hmm. Don't sit in the shield too long. I will take your life. Why and here we go. We got ourselves 70? a game. Why Jewel, is right? bringing his self ah! right back. He didn't have, did he have any magic? Because it looked like nothing came out on that downbeat. I don't know, but TV has to see the stock right now because this is, oh, Ooh. not gonna do it just yet. Okay. He's keeping the aura sphere small. So okay. purposely, you know, use the beer versus mm -hmm. his momentum. Yeah, he needs but to keep that movement option, uh, that movement tool as an option. Yeah, but at this point, his uh, dual shield is getting lower. He can just shoot these aura spheres and kind of just like break that shield eventually. Now, uh, he did, did he just go back here? He came back a reverse three stock. That was insane. And and the key and 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 the thing is, listen. VV didn't have aura that entire last stock. So yeah. it, it made it really hard for him to kill Jewel the way that he wanted. That missed tech to forward smash. And you can see here. Um how did, how did, okay, this is the uh the gimp. This is what happened. Like I don't Yep. Who? Oh, okay, so Lucario's yeah. the end of his hitbox hit uh Jewel, Jewel right into the bottom and then, of the stage. Exactly. And mm -hmm. then he didn't tech. Cause you the green the green little sparky thing came out, so he was able to he could have teched, but he, yeah. didn't, he didn't expect it because yeah. no one would expect it. He thought that. he was going to get the spike. Yeah, exactly. But um, nonetheless, that last stock was the beginning of this comeback for Jewel Endo. That was the double fire. He died, you know he died at 70, right? Double fire. Before that out smash, he was at 70. That's wild. Which means he started the um the combo. The bottom, that's where he at started. At like 40. That, look at that. Ooh, 70, damage. exactly 70. Damage! That was so much damage. That's a, that's a whole clip right there. That's a whole clip. That's wild. And VV did a good job of, like, you just got, lost two stocks. He did a good job of stopping the bleeding, resetting the neutral for that final stock where it was anyone's game. But Jewel just stayed that much more solid.